People would have expected the Toffees to be within touching distance of the visitors in the Merseyside derby. Lucy Hope could be out for six to eight weeks with the ankle injury she sustained. In comes Jace and Leah Galton. And Lucia Garcia comes in for Lisa Nelson, who is on the bench. Out, Walton Hall Park. And two draws. She really impressed it. Claire Wheeler when she came on against Liverpool last week. And she's found Sorensen. Turner tries to get close, but Sorensen gets the cross and it's given the European exit. They started brightly. Riviere with the low cross in. And it drops to Malar, who struck the woodwork, and she's in for the rebound as well. But Brosnan gets there. What an opportunity for Manchester United. She hit it so hard, but didn't quite what a get superb start to the season. And got a vital block there on Malar's shot. Low effort from Miyazawa, and Brosnan gets down to smother that. Miyazawa. Cuts back inside, goes with the left boot over the bar and onto the top of the net. Pitch. Low ball. It's coming Friday before heading out to Leuven for the return. Wheeler finds Sorensen. Sorensen with the cross onto it. Well, it was a cross shot which glanced off the fixture dates. I don't believe yet confirmed for United, but these teams will meet in the League Cup. Here comes Sorensen. For Everton, she's got plenty of space. Can she get the shot away? She does, but it's over the bar. Did it clip up off a United boot? She's won United this corner, but it's headed away by Van Havermark. Bjorn gets there, but heads it back to Malar, who glances the header in. Melvin Malar has given Manchester United the lead at Walton Hall Park. Well, then is snuffed out by Snoyce, but she wins it back to see Spanish international. Headed down by Paris and wide. Four Champions League titles, two French titles. Benison sweeps it wide. Everton have an opportunity here. The cross comes in towards the centre of the six-yard box and uh, Toon to Mallard. Plays it back to Toon. Gets the cross in. Miyazawa almost got on the end of it. And it whistles over the bar from Blundell. That's a decent challenge by Wheeler, who got there just ahead of Riviere. She's got space down. This left hand flank gets a cross in towards the far post. Goes over every Everton head. But the ball is still alive. The header comes in and wide of the post from Galley. Well, that was a really crop. Garthia just gets the World it. Cup has since returned to international duty. Turning the centre of the park from Benison, who has options, goes for goal herself, and Erps does well to fingertip it over the bar. Goes towards the far post, and it's glanced. Oh, it's given away to Sorensen, who takes a shot early. Erps gets down smartly to push it behind. Great reactions from the England goalkeeper. Target, the number eight, towering over pretty much every other player on the pitch. But it's gone over her head to Galley. Sorensen does really well there to glance it beyond Letizia. Strides into space. Still, Sorensen gets a shot. Garcia again turns a full 360 and finds Blundell, who gets the cross in and Paris with a really smart header Nikita from close range I mean, can look back at the best moments from an end of leading a match they've so often tune long ball over the top for Paris to chase Vi lets it go back Letizia lifts one over the top Paris will get on the end of it and tries to bring it back to Garcia is still alive Mallard gets there, turns, swivel, shoots, easy for Brosnan. Rolls it out to Garcia on the left, Payne wins it back momentarily, but Garcia is too strong and finds Toon, who rattles it over the bar. Well, she can certainly hit them from there. Everton make their 
first change. Looked long but played it short to Toon. Toon feeds it on to Garcia. Garcia gets a shot. Goal was and it's scrambled away from inside that six yard line. And Blundell with the shot which Brosnan clutches out of the air at the second. He lays it into the path of Riviere. Looping cross picks out Nikita Paris. Who came so close in the first half. This time she will not and be here. Hung up at the back post. Van Havermark gets the header on the edge of the six yard box. Almost drops to Bjorn. It's Benison with the shot. Back to Benison. She goes again. Back. And Sorensen picks it up. Vai on the charge. Let's fly. Just far, just wide of that far post. Van Havermark. Benison making way for Emma Bissell. Riviere gets hung up at the far post. It's the player making way for Rachel Williams. It's Hannah Blundell who departs for Gemma Evans. Both of Sorensen in plenty of space here. Turner gets across. Sorensen with the cross in, it comes off Letizia into the arms of Erps, but Vi gets there first. He tries to carry it away from Paris, who wins it back, knocks it into the area and it's tapped home, is it? No, it's saved by, well at the second attempt, certainly Rachel Williams bundles it home. Well, Rachel Williams has been on the field. Departs for Tony Duggan. Comes on for Nicolene Sorensen. Everton, any hope of rescuing something here. Wheeler keeps it. In. Bissell tries to scurry through the middle, but Riviere gets it back to Erps. Opportunity to materialise and sweeps it out to Riviere, who knocks a left footed cross in his headed down by Williams for a second of the afternoon. Once more, Brosnan got hands to it, but once more, Rachel Williams finds the back of the net. City bottom, no goal difference. Garcia looking for a fifth for United, curls it straight into the arms of Brosnan. Williams was again looking for a, a rebound, a 3 1 defeat to the French side. Miyazawa chips it over, Brosnan, Brosnan got hands to it once more, finds Williams heads it on to Guerrero, who chips it through the middle, Paris brings it down really well, and definitely lobs it over Brosnan, that is a sensational fifth goal for Manchester United, she's accidentally caught Brosnan in the process, here's hoping the Everton goalkeeper's okay, Paris has gone down in pain too. But that was really good build-up play from Manchester United. And such a smooth finish from Nikita Paris. Lovely.